Okay, so I've been invited uh, to give a talk to uh, students from the Dignity for Children Foundation. Uh, it's, it's a nice school uh, that helps children get an education and I've been invited to speak about journalism, my work, uh, storytelling uh, and well, kind of see if I can inspire them. <laughs> Thank you, Jeremy. Say hi. Hi. Oh, hi. Wait, wait, wait. I need to be in the picture too. Okay, say hi. Hi. All right. <laughs> This is my first time also I heard about the, the term sojo. So, uh, like what he say, he loves to do what okay? he loves to do, right? So, let me encourage all of you, all right? To be Zan, I had a great time. Easy. You have I to had have a great time. Time. These people are background, right? All right, a token of appreciation to Zan for coming all the way from Kota Kermini today. <laughs> Uh, can I ask two questions to the crowd? Yes. Can I? Two questions. I've got two questions. Who can answer these two questions to get a book from me? Oh. Right, this is this is a it's called Avengers on Kira and Nine Side. It's a graphic novel, so it's a comic book. Uh, I wrote this book. I didn't draw it. My friend did. Uh, it was about my time in Afghanistan. Okay. So my first question is. Zan Azli has three things that, uh, that, that describes his personality. Name those three things. I see the purple sweater. Should raise your hand first. Um, you're smart, handsome, and you're famous. Yeah, yeah. What's your name? Zan. Yeah, Zan. You got one more. Okay. Last question. Second question is going to be a bit harder. Three things I like about solo journalism. I don't know. Whoa, first, what's that? Okay. Low cost, uh, no, better communication, and better uh, uh, self-management. Moving around. Yeah! So the, the talk went well, I think the kids were really excited, I was excited, um, I like giving talks like this because uh, I get to share with people, when people like to ask me, uh, even when I'm giving talks like this, they say what are the highlights of my career and you know why I like doing what I'm doing, uh, and I like do, making films, I like journalism, I like writing, I like travelling, and the fact that I get to share this with people share the fact that I'm so excited and so happy about the thing about, about my work, about my career, share it with them, the joy, and hopefully that they can get inspired and they would actually want to do it too. But that's actually a big highlight of my work. And it's not my work itself that gives me the joy, it's the fact that, well, of course the work gives me a joy, but the fact that I'm able to share it with people, uh, the fact that I could inspire people, the fact that people might get excited about what I do and probably, hopefully, that they will want to do it too and they will find joy from that too. It's what makes me feel really happy about doing things like this, about giving talks like this. Um, and, you know, the D D Dignity for Children Foundation is really good. It's a school that gives an opportunity to children from any background uh, the right to an education, the right the right to be a human being and I like what they're doing I mean just check out go, go to their website go to their Facebook page see what they're doing you might like it too and support them uh, I think that they're doing a good job uh, so yeah and thanks Jeremy for inviting me to speak